Hello everybody, this is your boy Majora's Minion playing some more Binding of Isaac. Today we are doing another random character run because these are pretty fun. And we are getting Kane again. And we are starting off with Mom's Eyeshadow, which is actually not a good item. I really wish we could have started off with something else because Charm Tears are not really helpful. In fact, sometimes they can be the opposite of helpful. They can do bad. So hopefully we can get some other items to help this run not suck. <laughs> Kane's a pretty good character, so I'm not mad at all about getting him. That's a very short first floor, although they usually are, so it's not too surprising. I'm gonna try to take off these smaller enemies first. Just make monster a little easier. There we go. See, the issue with charm tears and enemies being charmed is it makes their movement a lot less predictable. Which is not something you want. Alright, starting off with speed ball. We are now speedy and our shots travel faster. Alright, not too bad. Definitely could have had some better items. However, that speed up is definitely going to help. And this is right around, in my opinion, the perfect speed. You can get up to two speed, but at that point you're going really fast. And it's, as you can see, I'm letting go once I'm done moving and I'm already sliding a little bit. Um, with max speed, to Two zero. That is even worse, as you can imagine. It makes it so you slide in enemy attacks more often, which is not something you want, obviously. All right, got our item room. I'm not 100% sure what that is. Odd mushroom fire. Okay, so we're shooting faster. We have less damage. Ooh. We're shooting a lot faster though. We're also moving a lot faster, which I'm not the biggest fan of. I'm hoping this fire rate is useful because that damage down was pretty significant. And as you saw right there, we almost slid right into the enemy, which was partly my fault, but. Not partly my fault, it was entirely my fault, but it would not have been even near that close had we not gotten that additional speed and got up to 1.9. Honestly, I think this uh, fire rate up, is, the tears up is pretty useful so far. Okay, that's a dime. We're going to do the boss first and see if it ends up being worth it. Because we can absolutely get that down without taking any damage. Oh, okay. Well, we took some damage, unfortunately. Which means we are not going to get a devil deal. Which is a pretty big bummer. We are going to get the safety pin. Which would increase our range, tier speed, and we got a black heart, as you can see. Uh, we are going to try for this dime. It's going to be kind of risky, and I'm not sure we're going to be able to do it. We were very close. Unfortunately, we did waste our black heart. Uh, there's just not really anything else for us to do here, because we already got our item room. We're not going to go to the shop yet. We might go to the shop on this next floor if we get some more money. And if we get some more keys. 
Uh, we don't have any bombs, so we can't even get to that if we wanted to. Alright, we did get another key. That's very nice to see. Alright, we got a poop room. Which is pretty easy, so I'm not going to complain about that at all. Man, I almost took a damage from a little poop. Imagine that. Alright, pretty easy. Got ourselves a key. Bomb room. Bomb fly room, rather. Oh, unfortunate damage there. Gosh darn it. Hopefully we can make up our percent. And get a double deal still. So we need to not take any more damage. Alright, so we're not going to go do that quite yet. Because I want to... Okay. I want to build up... A higher Devil Deal percent. First. So hopefully we can do that. We did get a black card. I am very happy about that. Uh, we also still need to find our item room, which there is our item room, and it looks like a, um, not entirely sure what those, these rooms right here are called. So we might go check out what's in there after our item room, see if it might be worth it. Lots of bats. Bats are pretty annoying, not gonna lie. Alright, I'm not 100% sure what that is, but we really don't have any bombs to change it. That $3 bill gives us rainbow tears. Okay, well, our damage went up there, so I'm not really sure at all what it does. It looks like it might give us a different tier effect every room. Um, that's tempting. You know, let's do it. Oh, it was worth it just in that one item. Okay, so yeah, it just alternates our tier effects every little bit. Wow, that was really short. Okay. Oh, and we got a bomb, so actually we can get another one of these chests. Um, I'm not 100% sure what that does, but we're going to go with it. And now we're up to a 36... Devil deal chance. I think it'll go up once we go in here. No, it doesn't. Oh my goodness, that's actually, like, amazing. We couldn't have got that at a better time. Oh, and we actually got a devil deal. Okay, first things first, we are absolutely grabbing this. Gives us flight and more speed. Okay, um... Dark matter, I don't remember being all that good, and I can't remember off the top of my head what this one is, but we're going to grab it. Okay, that isn't really that good at the moment. 
Um, once we have half a red heart or less, which means if we have no red heart containers and just are living off of soul hearts and stuff, we will have increased stats. Which, increased stats are very good. However, when they're only when you're almost dead, they're not quite as good. What is ringworm? Oh, okay, well that kind of... That, that actually will make us hit more, so I'm going to keep that one. Okay. Did not like that we got hit there. We're not going to do that because we still want to see our item room. You know, I think I'm going to go back and grab our pinky eye. Cause I, I I changed my mind on the hitting more. That is does not seem to be the case. Okay, we got a bomb. What is that? Mom's wig or something? Yeah, you feel itchy. I didn't see any stats go up or down, so I'm not entirely sure what that does. So we're just going to keep going. Oh, I see some spiders spawning. So I have a feeling it has something to do with that. Okay. These rainbow tears are pretty cool. Not going to lie. They could probably screw us over at any point. But for the time being, they're pretty fun and I am happy about them. They definitely helped us against the horsemen giving us the scythes like that. That was... That could not have gone better. Alright. Oh, we got triple shot right now. That's pretty neat. Oh, grab the bomb. Okay, there's the Horror of Babylon activating. Now we have more damage and stuff. However, we are one shot. One shot is not nice. Ooh, we got the scythes. Scythes are oh freaking feet. We are going to go in the shop here. And, of course, it is greed. So why wouldn't it be? That's not really useful. And that is a not huge amount of coins. But yeah, something tells me that gold key right there is going to be absolutely useless. Which is rather unfortunate, but not really anything we can do about it. Ooh, and their spread shot just got us. Alright, well, this is another short one, unfortunately. Not much I can do. As we do more and more of these, I should get better. I'm hoping at the very least. So hopefully, at some point, we start going on win streaks. But for the current time, we're going to have to settle for these. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to hit that like button if you did. Comment down below any suggestions you may have. And subscribe for some more content. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.